What you just heard was a shotgun blast from last Wednesday into the Silver Springs home in Marion County. And it kind of uh, made me freeze up a little bit and then I got angry. The blast whittled his mobile home on Northeast 59th Terrace with holes. It happened just after 5 a.m. Joe Burge was working and wasn't home, but his wife and young children were. My uh, middle daughter, she's uh, 15. She was the one that heard the shot in the morning. Look at all the holes on the side of the house facing the street and then exit holes inside the house, including his 14-year-old son's bedroom. There are shots in between his bed and a dresser. It's, it was about two foot away from his head and it went straight through the wall. The family contacted the Marion County Sheriff's Office and though it's dark, you can see the car come by and then boom. We caught it on camera, but you couldn't get a clear vision of the car because the street light was out. He says the light has been out for months. The city of Ocala's Utilities Division maintains the street light. We talked to a spokesperson who requested the status of the light and is waiting on a response. The report says a deputy spoke with a neighbor who said the blast might have been meant for his house and not Joe's. The neighbor told detectives his own friend told him he would shoot him because they were arguing over setting up an online gaming console. Meanwhile, Joe Burge and his landlord have taken all precautions to keep his family safe. It's just scary, really scary, you know, makes me makes my family uneasy, no longer feel safe in our house. I'm Gail Pascal Brown, West 2 News.